do just a little bit of a vlog. Started out with a little bit of before and after. I didn't show you me doing it, but I have cut the grass today. I've also weed eaten a little bit around the garden, straightened up, got the bird bath ready for winter. And I must have had two feet deep on leaves out there. You can see they're still shedding all over the ground, but I had it looking clean a while ago. The leaves were two feet deep out there under the tree. I got most of them chopped up and blew away. I cut until I was almost out of gas. I didn't have a whole lot of gasoline left or I would, I'd probably still be out there. Last week I did a vlog on medical updates and I never did follow up on that. And I thought I'd just fill you in a little bit briefly. The doctors took me off of the Eliquis. It's a blood thinner. I was having some trouble with some bleeding. And um, I can't rule out the fact that the Eliquis did help me a little bit because my leg ain't swelling quite as bad as it was. I'm still getting a lot of swelling in my leg. So the vein doctor prescribed me to wear um, compression socks. And that's just socks that come up to about your knees and fit real tight. And uh, it seemed to me that would restrict your uh, blood flow. But the way the doctor explained to me, it helps push the blood up in your arteries, which are big veins, back to your heart easier than where your heart don't have to work so hard to pump the fluids back up out of your legs. So people would congestive heart failure, you, you do get a lot of swelling in your legs. So these compression socks I bought, he prescribed them, so I went to a place called the compression shop in Griffin. And you wouldn't believe what them things cost. You can't just slip it on your foot if it's so tight, you have to buy a little metal bracket to hook it on, make it easier to get your foot down in there. So I got that, that was $55. And so two pair of socks and that Duflunker came to two hundred and sixty dollars or something like that. Two pair of compression socks is that that sounds kind of high for socks. They didn't have any in stock, so they ordered them. Told me they'd call me in a day or two. They got collected their money. And, uh, they haven't called me yet, so I haven't picked them up. I think I'll wind up buying the rest of my compression socks on um, Amazon or somewhere. Some of you viewers out there that might wear compression socks can maybe fill me in on a more reliable place to order from. But you have to know what size to buy. They have to measure your feet. I'm looking at some mistletoe up in the bottom top of that. Um, maple tree out there silver maples what that is but all in all my yard's looking pretty good i'll get me some more gas and probably get out in the back and do some more burning pretty soon i just want to do a little update on my yard work out here today Sure is a pretty time of year. And look at that big oak tree over there. It's going to shed leaves all over the place. And that's going to finish shedding. I've got leaves blowing off the neighbor's property. So I'll have to do another episode of leaf churning. Mowing. But I started getting my garden back in shape and weed eat it around. Maybe next year we'll do better with our zinnias. Thanks for listening to me talk a little bit. I do hope y'all have a good week. Be Walpar, wishing everybody well. Mm -hmm.